The Oregon State University researchers say one of the most active volcanoes off the coast of Oregon should erupt again this year. But don't worry, the volcano is 100 or more miles out in the ocean and deep down too. Still, Devin Haskins explains why scientists have such a big interest in this deep sea volcano. 300 miles off the coast of Oregon, with its summit about a mile under sea, sits a small but very active volcano that could erupt at any time. It's called the Axial Seamount, and it's located along the Juan de Fuca Ridge. We happen to know that it's erupted three times in the last 30 years, so, uh, you know, that's more than our the volcanoes we usually see in our backyard in the Cascades. Bill Chadwick is a research associate with Oregon State University's Hatfield Marine Science Center. He says the volcano last erupted in 2015. It's a pretty special place. It's, you know, probably the most well-monitored submarine volcano on the planet. He and a team of researchers are constantly monitoring the volcano's activity from land as well as every two years spent at sea aboard a research ship. So what we've observed is that it has a pretty regular cycle between one eruption to the next. Chadwick says between each eruption, the ground swells as the magma underneath builds up. And as research shows, it's about time for another one. I think it will erupt before the end of this year, before the end of 2025. But don't worry if and when it does erupt, he says there's no danger to any of us. It's not going to cause a tsunami. It's just not, you know, it's deep, it's offshore. It has... During an eruption, there's lots of earthquakes, but they're tiny earthquakes. Um, it's not going to cause a subduction zone earthquake. They're, they're just too far apart. So it's, it's perfectly safe. Chadwick says if they can correctly predict an eruption in an active volcano like this one, they hope to use what they learn and apply it to more dangerous volcanoes that we have here on land. I'm Devin Haskins, KGW News.